Do you know, some places aren't like traditional tourist spots. Despite the fact that, as a species, we have managed to explore pretty much every bit of land that exists on this planet. There is still so much around that we know nothing about, especially when it comes to what may lie below us. Not only does this include things that are underground, but deals with things that are underwater as well. There is so much about the ocean we do not yet know about, so it's no surprise that there are ruins waiting under there to be discovered. Here is one more thing to tell, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon. We all know that many cities of the world have water, rivers, water parks, and beaches in them, but we rarely know about the cities that are under the water completely. Today we will know about the seven famous cities that now are under water. Not only that we will also know about the accidents and incidents that lead to the destruction of the cities and also about the citizens of these long lost cities. So without wasting any time let's start. The Roman city of Baiae. This city is found under the Bay of Naples in Italy. Some 600 years ago, this city was set up for the richest people of Italy. The luxurious hotels, houses, swimming pools, and other extravagant things that were only accessible by rich people of the time were found in the ruins of this city. The Roman king Nairobi II used to come to this city for spending holidays and for spending some hours in peace. This city indeed was a dream location for many people. Suddenly the water of the Bay of Naples started to rise and the city was drowned. Divers and scientists have found the ruins of the city underwater and they say that till date the ruins of an old yet luxurious city are in water. We can only wonder at what this could have possibly looked like years ago. The city of Thonis Heraklion. The ruins of this city were found in 2001 in Egypt. Thonis Heraklion was located near the river Nile. This city is believed to be drowned some thousands of years ago. This ancient city was a port too. Ships used to come to this city for trading purposes. Now researchers have found 60 to 70 cruises and also they found expensive items like gold and silver in the ruins of the city. The statues and sculptures that once used to stand tall in the city also are seen underwater in a perfect condition. It is believed that at the end of 2nd century BC the flood destroyed everything of the city. It's important to remember that no matter how important somewhere is, it won't always be that way. The city of Shicheng. It was located in the province Hangzhou of China. You won't believe the story of this city, the ruins of this city were found under the Lake Qiandao, it was used to be the home of 300,000 people. In 1959, to meet the electricity demand of the people of this city a dam was built, however the dam drowned the whole city. The people from the city were shifted to a safe place, some people believe that the city was drowned intentionally, while some say that the city was drowned by accident. The city was also known as the City of Lions, now the statue's lions are seen underwater and the buildings, roads and all five doors of this city now belong to the water of the Lake Qiandao. The City Yonagunijima The ruins of that city were discovered in 1985 from the island of Japan. The ruins suggest that the city existed more than 5,000 years ago. The city is believed to be destroyed by a huge earthquake some 2,000 years ago, the researchers were worried about discovering a pyramid that was 82 feet tall in the ruins of the city. The architecture of the building is very mysterious and is not believed to be made by a man. Scientists believe that the city was made naturally and was destroyed centuries ago. We don't think that we will ever end up visiting somewhere that has been around on the planet for this long. If we do, we'll be too scared to touch anything. The villages under Atabad Lake. This lake is 21 feet long and 358 feet deep extremely beautiful lake located in Hunza Valley of Pakistan. It was discovered in January 2010, people from all over the world visit this lake, but little did they know that this lake is the home to many cities. In January 2010, due to dangerous landsliding, the flow of the water of Hinza Lake was blocked. Due to the blockage of water there was a huge flood in many villages that used to exist in place of Atabad Lake. Over 25,000 people suffered due to this situation and the homes, shops, and belonging of people still are inside the water of the beautiful Atabad Lake. To think that people will manage to find more than one thing in these underwater ruins is amazing isn't it? The city of Port Royal, Jamaica. This city was famous all over the world for its pirate activities. 
This city was also known as the most sinful city. In June 1692, a 6.2 magnitude hit the city and caused two-third of the portion of the city to sink. The earthquake and the drowning of the city killed more than 2,000 people. People who survived the dangerous accident said that the earth opened and swallowed as many people as it can. But some people say that the earthquake and the drowning was the punishment for the sins of the inhabitants of the city. To think that there was a time when this now underwater city would be overrun by the very people that ruled the sea at the time. The sunken city of Cuba. A company called Advanced Digital Communication was working on Cuban water in 2001. They were trying to discover the sunken Spanish ships with treasure in them. They found the ruins of a huge city and the city was known as the sunken city of Cuba. Scientists and the researchers believe that it is a pretty old city with architecture and buildings made up of ancient civilization. Just thinking about how long this place went unnoticed sends out head off into spirals of confusion. That's all for today's, stay tuned for future videos. If you want to know about the creepy discoveries by archaeological digs, then click on the left side video on screen.